Hello again everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is LMA Manager Part 6 now. And yeah, if you watched the previous episode, you could see that we drew and our last two games, um, leaving us still unbeaten. One of three teams that are unbeaten with Arsenal, Tottenham Hotspur. Uh, one of three teams, yeah, sorry, with Arsenal and Tottenham Hotspur. Uh, it's very unfortunate that Tottenham Hotspur are one of them. Anyway, right, okay, so we are going to... I think we're going to change things up a little bit. I'm not too sure that 4-4-2 is actually... 4-3-3, uh, um, sorry, is actually working for us. So um, I do like whether or not they're going to have this as an option. Wow, they, they really don't. Um, I quite like a 4-3-1-2 um, um, formation or a 4 one, uh, sorry, a 4 one 3 2 formation. Um, with one defensive midfielder, three midfielders, uh, two two forwards. Um, I really am against having um, I really am against only having three defenders. Don't like that at all. Five two three. Don't like having two midfielders. Three four three. Again, don't like having three defenders. So it's either going to be a four three three or a four four two. Really, they're the main two formations that I'm going to go for. Um, I think we're going to go for a four, the, the old classic four four two, and see how we get on. Um, I'm still going to stay attacking. I do need to now um, figure out who is in what position. So Steve Potts is a right defender, which is correct. A Rogers is a left back, which is correct. Uh, Joe Cole, um, which is number four, which is central midfield, which is what I want. Um, and then we've got Rio Ferdinand, uh, number five, which is what I want. And number six is what I want for Ian Pierce. Number seven is what I want there. And Di Canio is going to probably take the reins up top with Ian Wright. So we're going to take off one chop for now. And we're going to replace one chop with um, a midfielder. And that midfielder is either going to be Michael Carrick or um, Jorgensen. In fact, it's actually going to be... Jorgensen. Uh, so Jorgensen, number eight, needs to be um, left midfield. So he needs to replace Frank Lampard. Uh, Jorgensen there on the left, Frank Lampard in the middle, Marcus Vivian Foe, number seven on the right, and Joe Cole in the middle as well. And we've got De Canio and Ian Wright up top. Right. I think I... Is De Canio, Danny De Canio is 31. Need to start looking at replacing him at some point as well. Um, maybe next season. Uh, AS Monaco have again rejected my offer. This isn't looking likely. I think I offered six and a half million last time. Let's increase that to eight. Oh, do you know what? Eight and a half. I've got 11 million quid now, so something. Uh, I think it's because I've, no, I haven't sold anyone yet, and they're still got, they're still ongoing. Right, well, let's go to the next day anyway. See how we get on. Oh, so good playing these again. Really enjoy this, and I really hope you enjoy watching this too. I think actually, um, as of counting, I've got 134 subscribers, and I, <laughs> I mean to me that's just magic. It really is. Um, and I really hope that even a quarter of them, if they even watch this, then, you know, thank you. Uh, but, and of course, uh, you know, put some recommendations in. What games do you like? What would you like to see from any generation of console, whatever? Yeah, I'll play it. Okay, I'll play whatever you want. As long as you're happy, I'm happy. I need to get back into the rhythm of doing this, though. I really am looking forward to um, doing this passion project of mine, this retrospective, um, because it is of one of my favourite franchises of all time, giving you a clue there, if anyone's seen some of my previous videos. Um, so really looking forward to kind of doing my research, talking about it, recording some videos. I'm going to try and go through all the ports of the game. Uh, so very much looking forward to that. But obviously that's going to take time. 
So yeah, also looking forward to, to editing these. Um, and the, the, these games, I must admit, these Let's Plays Welcome don't really... Oh, hello. The CEFA Cup first round. Isn't that the UEFA Cup? I love these. I can't not watch these. Number 73. Rapid Vienna. I, I don't even know if we're even in this. But I'm pretty sure the draws only happen for teams that are in these Number tournaments. 34. Grasshopper Zurich. <laughs> okay. I'm, we'll see. There's going to be a lot of teams drawn out here, so... Number 19... CSK. Do you know what? I'm going to skip him. Okay, so we were in it. Um, so we've been drawn against Tyrrell Innsbruck. All right. Um, well, okay, fair enough. We'll, we'll definitely watch the league, the 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 the, the, the league cup and and then the FA Cup draws. But I didn't know that we were even in there. I, that, I'm pretty sure that was the UEFA Cup, um, uh, which is now obviously the Europa League. They've accepted, and he wants. I don't know how much to offer him. Let's do thirty grand a year, three years, win bonus, make offer. I don't know if I can't remember if thirty grand a year is good. Oh shit! Where's my team? Where's my team? Ah, four, eight, fifteen, twenty-one. Rio Ferdinand, eleven, ten. 18, 8, 12, 14, 16. Shit. I've given him way too much fucking money. Even Jorgensen's only on 6. And I've just give, I've just offered 30. Well, he's going to be like one of the highest paid players in the Premier League. <laughs> okay, we're at Valley Parade. Bradford City versus West Ham United. Um, Paul Jewell. Bloody hell. Bradford City, um, I think these guys, these guys were... I think they were pushovers. Um, but I've switched to a 4-4-2. Let's see whether or not this formation works. Now, we're still building up the play. We're not going direct. So we'll see whether the build-up play works. If not, then I'll, I'll change that depending on whether or not we look um, dominant in the game. I can't remember West Ham having a white kit in 99. I thought we had um, a blue away kit, but obviously I'm wrong. Right, here we go. So, we're starting off, I mean, it's a midfield battle at the minute, but we do seem to be having a bit more of the possession. Good start, good start, and a shot on goal. A very weak shot on goal, but a shot on goal. All right. Oh. See, so he's going through. And it's a penalty. That's what we want to say. Come on. Let's see if we can get one nil. Oh. Straight at the keeper. Very unfortunate. I say unfortunate. He, he put it straight down the bloody middle. So what did I expect to happen? And now we've just conceded a foul. Very much this midfield battle going on here. We need to... That's it. Good, 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 good. Oh, that was inches, you know. Whistled past the post. Again, it just worries me. Every time they've got the ball and they start to attack, it worries me because we could do with a better goalkeeper as well. You know, the whole West Ham squad in 99 just needed a complete overhaul, really. I mean, we, we weren't amazing, but we weren't terrible. All right, can you, Ian... Did I take off Ian right now? I'll put on Paolo Wancho. I don't know. Who's taking this free kick? It's a bit too far out anyway. Oh, he's hit the beans. Oh, my God. He's hit the beans on toast. Did he hit the post or did he hit the bar oh, I can't even tell but the rebound went over and that have just like, pinched the ball from us in our own half so we can't change the tactics on the fly like you could in LMA manager 2001 come on oh right at oh where did that come from 
nicked it and took that shot. Good defending. Oh, come on, good defending. This is this is looking this is looking good. Do you know what? That first half, I'm happy with that. Very happy with what I've seen in that first half. We've hit the post or the bar, um, and we've we've I think we've had some decent possession. Let me just um, see if I'm right about the possession there, or whether I'm talking shit. Uh, yeah, I'm talking shit. Um, we've had less possession, to be perfectly honest. Um, but we have had two shots on target, five shots attempted. So still looking, looking good. I'm, I'm, I'm happy with that first half, and he's just running it through me. If he scores, I'm gonna. Oh, I would have left my seat. Good defending again. This is what we want to say. I didn't check to see where Bradford City were in the league before we before we played them. Um, I always check to see. I tend to normally check where where teams are in the. Oh fuck. I was going to say, I tend to check where they are in the league to gauge whether or not we, we should be beating them. So, Blake's had a red card now, so we, we've got one extra man for the next, you know, 35 minutes or so. Come on, yes! Get in! Well done to Canio what we want to say um, I don't really want to make a swap just yet either I'm going to carry on we'll wait to the 60 we'll give it another 10 minutes or so before we make a swap maybe the 70th minute just depending on what's happening oh, fuck off oh shit you prat Ian Pierce. now what the fuck am I supposed to do well Um, well, that's just ruined my game. Uh, hey, Rogers, I can't. I'm gonna have to leave it as it is. Play him out of position. And I, I can't work out if it's a penalty or a free kick, either, because that looks like a penalty to me. Yep. Yeah. Oh, you absolute. Beautiful man. There's not really much we can do here. I think we're just going to have to see this game out. Hope for the best. We've got Decanio up front all by himself. He, there's no better man to leave up there. He's gone. He's gone. And he's missed. So. 10-10. We were... We had the advantage and now we've got no advantage whatsoever. Come on, ref! Get him off. Send him off. Get him on! Oh, corner. Corner at least. Can we get something out of this set piece? I don't think you can change your set pieces in this as well. I think it's just literally as is. So now we've got another free kick. They're playing dirty. Oh, straight at the keeper. Oh, I don't know what happened there. Oh dear, now Foley's... Why are we getting the yellow cards? Biased ref. Um, right, let's take off Foley. I can't afford another sending off. Foley's on the right. Um, okay. What is he blowing for? Nothing even happened. He just went up to the ball and farted on it. <laughs> right, where's Carrick? He's out of position. We got any players that can go to the right? Joe Cole can't. Can Jorgensen? No. Just gonna have to leave him out of position. How many more? One more sub. One chop. 
still think Decanio is the best person to leave there. I'm wondering if it might be worth. I've just brought Carrick on. <clears throat> Taking off Joe Cole. Sinclair. Let's have a Trevor Sinclair Palo de Canio link up like he did against w uh, Wimbledon. Oh! Could see it in his eyes. He wanted to shoot. He's got that look. He wants to see the net bulge. Don't give him an inch. This is it. Last attack. Last attack. Come on. This is it. This is it. This is it. Yes! You beauty. That Trevor Sinclair, Paolo Di Canio link up. I was right. What a beautiful goal. Dead pleased with that. Beauty. Second win of the season. Where's that going to put us? It's got to be top five. Get in. Beautiful. Absolutely brilliant. What a, what a change. I'm pleased the new formation's working. Right, I don't want to watch him. Come out there. Don't want to see that. How many games have we played now? Didn't we eight games maybe? Something like that. No? Yeah? No? Less? Five? Six? Six games? In the season. Just end the season right now. I mean I'm sure we're flying high in the table now. We still haven't beat Ian Pierce. He's been banned for one match due to his misconduct. Sheffield United have made an offer for G uh Holligan, which isn't gonna happen. And funny enough, he's accepted my terms. <laughs> because who fucking wouldn't? At 30 grand a year at that stage. And we're third in the league. Oh, that is number wang. Fucking yes. Right, it's looking good. The only, you know, Tottenham Hotspur above us. Arsenal won't be pleased with that. No one needs to knock Tottenham Hotspur off their, off their little uh, pedestal there. Knock them down a few pegs. Um, I've got Steve Potts there now, who's going to be replaced with uh, this chap. Steve Potts can now go on the bench, and Stuart Pearce is most likely going to be um, at some point sold off. Such an ageing team. 30, 37, 31. You know, um, even, you know, Moncur, 32. Potts, 32. De Canio, 31. Ian Wright, 35. Such an ageing team. Anyway, um, I need a right back. So Potts is going to come back on anyway. Um, let's put Minto on the bench. Uh, no, let's put Pierce back on the bench. Fuck. That's it. Right. Um, we probably don't have much money left now. Two million quid. Okay. Well, I don't know whether or not we'll buy any more players. I think the transfer market... I can't remember when it shuts. <laughs> um, whether it did shut back in 99... Don't remember. Maybe it does. Maybe it don't. I don't. Oh God, I don't remember. It's just a long time ago now. We are thirtieth of August. You know I mean? Maybe the transfer window shuts in September. Kind of like it does anyway. I can't remember. I was pretty sure it used to start. Oh, what we've gone down? Because Coventry City of all teams have overtaken us. Wow, eleven points from six games. Coventry City. Who is our next game then? Let's see if we can kind of prepare for this. Watford, who are sitting in 15th place. Yeah, I mean, look, Bradford City in 16th, so it's probably no wonder why we beat them. They're kind of the whipping boys of the league. Um, whereas the teams we've been playing, Leicester City, Southampton, Tottenham, um, Liverpool, um, top 10 teams who we've been getting results 
decent-ish results against. Manchester United, 7th. It's ambitious nowadays. Arsenal, top. What a different league this was back then. Man City, not nowhere to be seen. And Newcastle as well. Newcastle, nowhere to be seen. Oh, no, they are. Uh, next day. Manager in the dog. Fucking have it! Exit that. We'll see. We'll get another game in easy. We'll easily get another game in here. Tuesday the 31st. Winter in September. The transfer market going to close. Well, that's really screwed me over now. Well, Neil Ruddock has entered the team. He's entered the battle. We've gone down again because Leicester City has now taken over. Uh, good on him. Second place. Tottenham have got a game in hand as well. Chelsea got two games in hand. Obviously, European games have uh, taken their priority. Um, oh, dear. Okay. <laughs> 1st of September. Does the transfer market close? To close or not to close? That is the question. Barnsley have offered money for a player that I can't afford to let go. Manager of the Month award goes to Arsene Wenger of Arsenal. First Division, no, I don't care about those. Bills for this month come to 616 grand. And I've got £2 million in the bank. Okay, fine. Uh. Next day. I should really check out my training schedule. I don't know what's going on with that. So obviously the transfer market didn't close in 99. I honestly don't remember whether or not it closed. Clearly it doesn't. It doesn't. I would have closed by now. Training. Right, it's team, team, training. Is this training? Yeah, diving saves. It's fitness, his diving's not bad. Distribution, handling. He slops injured, okay. Yeah, no, let's keep him on diving. What's, what's that, requesting? Oh, fucking requesting. Get me eyes tested. Resting. Right, okay. Yeah, okay, we'll leave that at that. Tackling's good. Tackling's alright. Tackling, tackling, tackling. Midfield. His passing's decent. I think maybe we can get him working on his... Uh, Get him working on his tackling a little bit. Fabi's on passing. Um, let's get him on marking. Oh, you can go to previous. No, so I should read them. Um, Ian Wright shooting. I mean, yeah. Who Holligan? Leave him on shooting. One shot. Yeah, marking definitely. Decanio tackling. Yeah, I suppose. Marking for Jorgensen. Yeah, he's passing. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, right, okay, that's fine. When's our next day? What day is it? Friday. Ah, oh, so it must be tomorrow. Our match against uh, Watford City. Hmm. 
Yeah, this is one thing I would like to do, and I've probably mentioned this in the past as well, is doing this by myself isn't um, easy because I've got no one to bounce off of and I really do have a... I mean, I do have a stupid sense of humour and if I had someone who had a stupid sense of humour with me, um, then things would get a lot more interesting. But I don't really have anyone to do these things with anymore. Uh, I used to do some stuff with a pal called James but um, that kind of didn't work out. It started quite positive, but um, he moved and he moved a bit further away, I think, and left the company that I work for, so we just don't really talk anymore. It's just a shame. Hey-ho. When is this game? Fucking hell, it feels like forever. Eleventh of September. Bloody hell. Okay. It's a bit bit away. Bit of a way away. Let's just keep going. Skip, 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 skip. Then we move on. There's not much else to see here. This is the part of the video which you would fast forward to the next match day. Could probably edit it out to be honest with you, make it a little bit shorter because I'm not going to be doing anything. Is anyone else playing? It doesn't look as if anybody else is playing anyway right now, so I wonder if it's internationals <laughs> or something to why there's such a big break. <coughs> it's only a game, so I put up a real good fight. I'm going to be snookering you tonight. I play for my aim, so you better believe I'm right. I'm going to be snookering you. Snookering you tonight. Big break. Come up to the big day. All the, at least all the players will be rested uh, for this game, and hopefully we can win convincingly. Because if we do, then if results go our way, um, we could potentially go up to maybe I'd say realistically we could potentially go up to third again. But we've got to just wait for the results around us and hope that we even win our game. I'm thinking too far ahead. Uh, we might not even win. But it's a, it's, it's a game that I would expect to win against Watford City, um, being, um, I guess, being biased. But based on our results as well, um, no Man City, you cannot have him. Not for all the money in the world. I've got to save him for now. Right, here we go. Upton Park, Bowling Ground, West Ham Watford, Clash of the Titans, London Derby. P. Kennedy. <gasps> Mr. Kennedy! Kennedy! Right, we're staying with the 4 4 2 formation. Referee blows. Let's get this show on the road. Here he goes. Here we go. Oh! Oh, fuck me. I thought he scored. That must have been a save. What a save! I thought he scored. <laughs> Fucking minute, first minute of the game. Here we go. Oh, and that's a bad miss. Cool, bloody hell, he got back in time for that, didn't he? He was well offside. That's it, that's it, that's it. Penalty. Right. Not straight at the keeper this time. Ooh. You'll love to see it. If there's one thing that we like to see when playing a management game, it's bulging nets. 
Come on. Oh, I thought we were going to get two. And it's nice to be ahead. I'm pretty sure that... Uh, I can't remember if the last game we, we, we won against Bradford, whether we went 1-0 up or not. Anyway, keeper saves that. Distributes it out to the defence. Defence making a run. We've intercepted again and we're on the attack. This is looking very, very positive here. Um, we've got our new defender in play, but obviously now we've got Neil Ruddock in defence. Let's go on, come on, come on. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Anywhere else and it's a goal. Again, they're taking us down. What's going on here? Are they, uh, are they frightened of us? In are they also playing the dirty, dirty game? Are they trying to rile us up so that we make a city challenge and, and, and get a player sent off or something? What is, what is their tactic? Oh, there's a little bit of uh, distortion in the image in there. That'll be the cable that I'm using. Um, the level height cable <laughs> that I did actually rave about, but it's actually the back of the uh, the back the back of the PlayStation probably just needs a wiggle. And um, really, really bad news. Um, so one chop's coming on. One chop is going to come on. Um, really poor. That Picanio has gone off. Really disappointed about that. Oh boy. What can you do? Our, our top strikers off the pitch. Can we get it? Can we make it? No. We need some comfort now because, like, we uh, we need to win convincingly which we haven't done um, since the Liverpool game. There we go. Super sub, one chop. Beautiful. 2-0. Still not over yet. Plenty of time for them to, to, to come back into this here. But we play this safe. Keep attacking. Why not? Make it three. Go on. Make it three. There we go. I think um, one chop again. Brilliant. Playing well. It's looking good. Getting a good bit of goal difference now, which will help our uh, help our case in the league. Not from there. It's a bit far. Not from there. Not from there. Not from there. He's gone for it. It's gone over. Oh, he didn't even. <laughs> I thought it was a deflection. Bloody hell! I didn't even. Didn't even take a deflection. That just. Um, that was just sky high. Good defending. Terrible defending. Steve Potts just held on to it. Took the ball. Held on to it. Conceded the goal. Needed. Really disappointing not to get a clean sheet. Very unfortunate. Really wanted a clean sheet. Okay. Probably time to make a sub now. We've already made one, obviously, with Decanio going off the field. Hmm. Yeah, that's me wiggling the, the cable, by the way. For those wondering, it's a little bit loose. Oh, I'll stop, I'll stop with you in it. Sorry. Leave it. I'll leave it. I'll leave it alone. It's obviously a plan. It's on actual hardware, so getting these kind of cables is tough. I haven't made that sub. I was too busy playing with my cable. 
Two subs for the last portion of the game. We'll have Foe for Carrick, Cole, Sinclair. Go. Off they go. I mean, the game is in the bag. I'm very confident that we're going to win this anyway, but... There we go. Would have been nice to, to be in a bit more convincing, but... I mean, 3-1 is convincing, but conceding the goal is what I didn't, didn't really want. But 3-1, you can't argue with that. Very, very happy. Let's come out of that. Don't want that. We'll see where we are in the league. So we've got, we've got a bit of an injury crisis going on as well, which is really concerning now that Di Canio, Rio Ferdinand um, and a few others, Hislop, injured. Um, very concerning that we've got an injury crisis. And he's also out for a month. Really long periods of time that I'm losing these players for as well. And we are currently fourth because Coventry and Leicester won. But we have jumped above Tottenham. But they've got two games in hand. So we can only hope that they um, slip up. Well, I think that about does it for this episode as well. So six episodes in the bag. Seven games down. <coughs> Excuse me. We're averaging one game per episode i think that can um, be improved upon <coughs> excuse me dry throat now i've been talking for so much so i really do hope you enjoyed these videos and i will continue to do some more because i really enjoyed playing them and i'll see you in the next one thanks very much for watching chaps see you later